Really, at any point, we're always trying to keep a close eye on our budgets and we realised that our energy bills are always increasing. And so we had to look at resources and looking at sustainable energy and trying to reduce those bills. And that took us on a, a journey um, towards solar. When it comes to utilities, uh, we're not a church that's open on a Sunday and then closed the rest of the week. We run really from half eight in the morning. We have people here to 11 o'clock at night most week, uh, most days of the week. Um, it's a very busy building. We have administration staff, um, we have offices, we have lots of things going on from youth to children um, and just different events happening, etc. But all of these cost money. And so again, energy and for us to have solar panels on the roof, and, and to have that producing during the day and for us to be using that uh, is first class, is brilliant. Whenever we started looking into solar, it was amazing that it seemed to pop up at the same time and in every corner there was someone talking about solar panels and um, I then bumped into an individual who was working for a company called Amber Green. Checked out the reputation of the company and they seemed very viable and and so we started on that journey with Amber Green and looking at it as more of a, a viable opportunity and a, and a business plan moving forward. We are always, um, as a church, trying to look at how do we reduce bills, like utility bills, etc. Because uh, as a church, we are about people and we like to spend money helping people rather than money on utilities. Um, we saw the, the financial incentives of really rock payments and reducing our electric bills and then selling back into the grid and all of that looked viable to us. Um, we also wanted and we feel as a church that it's important that we are an example and not just on spiritual things but on practical things so for us it was important uh, to say to our community around us that we are into sustainable energy. As well as solar, uh, we've also looked into biomass. Um, we're really looking at reducing any of, our energy, any of our energy bills. And so biomass was a, another thing we're looking at. We burn a lot of oil around here. Uh, things seem to be getting colder. And um, so we've increased insulation, done some of those practical things, but we also have to take some of the big hits and realize that perhaps we need to replace our heating systems uh, in order to uh, really reduce costs. And again, those costs can go back to people. So for us, there's a, there, there a number of reasons. Primarily, we want to help people. We want to love people and show them that. And if we can save 100 pounds, 200 pounds, 500 pounds or whatever, that all goes directly to people. And people matter to God.